It's true. I've had tremendous success in my career, whether it be in business and finance, politics, or even higher education. You name it, I've done it. Award-winning accountant, former Michigan State Representative, former candidate for mayor in the city of Detroit, an advisor to the mayor of the city of Detroit. In fact, his first chief of staff. And now I'm back in a space doing what I absolutely love, speaking for a living, empowering others, pouring into their lives, helping them to know that it's not about what Lisa has done. I've done it, but if I can do it, you can do it too. But here's the thing, when you do it, I want you to do it even better. And so what I wanna do for you today is give you the seven steps to building wealth and leaving a legacy that lives well beyond your existence. How many of you wanna be able to do that? All right, fantastic. One of the things that I want all people to do is to adopt the candy girl mentality. What is that? It's the entrepreneur's mindset. That individual is unstoppable, and they recognize that life is not happening to them, but happening for them. You gotta earn it. Nobody's gonna give you anything in this life. Everything that you're going to get out of this life, you gotta work for it. That means you gotta roll up your sleeves, right? That means you gotta put on your boots, right? And if you don't have straps, create some, because you can pull yourself up by them. Lisa Howes is such a fantastic ambassador for the economy. She's dynamic, she's passionate, she's authentic. I get really excited about learning new things. The reason is because I know that I'm not learning it just for me. I'm learning it with the purpose of passing it on to the next person. We must be patient with ourselves and we must be patient with the process. Everything is not going to happen in our time when we want it to happen. On the contrary, it's only going to happen when it's supposed to to happen. Great takes patience. And what better person to teach this to your organization than Lisa Howe. That's what she was able to do for me, teaching me how to be patient as I level up in my success. When organizations book me, they're not just getting a speaker. They're partnering with a business professional. And so from the very beginning, they understand that I'm vested in their story. My goal is to deliver the most value as possible. And in order to do that, I go through a discovery conversation with them. In that conversation, I'm looking for three things. Number one, what's your North Star? Where is it that you're trying to go? Secondly, I wanna know what are your points of pride? What are those accomplishments that you've recently had that we can build upon? And last but not least, what are your points of pain? What challenges do you see that could prevent you from reaching your North Star? Once I understand all of those things, then they believe that I can deliver. My goal, however, is to help them believe in themselves.